In this video, we'll show you how to get started with your Forerunner 110. When you get your Forerunner out of the box, you may want to give it a full charge first. And once you have the full charge, you're ready to turn it on. And the on off button is also the light button, so we'll press on that to turn it on. And we'll go through the, the profile wizard, if you want to call it, to get it set up. You want to choose your language, and to hit enter is the page menu button and we can select our units time format our age I'll put in an age weight and there you go now your GPS is ready to acquire some satellites we can hit OK if we want here we got a progress bar and if we are indoors, we happen to be indoors because can't find the satellites. There you go. Now we're back to our screen. Now we can uh, move this to the computer and uh, see if there's any software updates to install. Now I plugged in the Forerunner 110 to my Mac and I downloaded and ran Garmin Web Updater. There's a couple ways you can uh, check if you need to update your software. Web, web Updater is an easy one to uh, to use and uh, it detected uh, the device via the USB cable and right here we're indicating that we have uh, a software update and uh, so what we can do we can read about the fixes for each of the versions so we're a couple versions back so we're gonna update it by simply clicking on update and we'll read the software license agreement hit agree we'll download and update at this point we'll just sit back and let the web updater do its job and we'll come back once it's all done alright now we see that it's all done we'll follow the instructions to disconnect the device from the computer and allow it to start up so we'll flip it back to the forerunner alright software update just finished uh, on the computer and we're just gonna disconnect it and we'll let it update itself And now it's just restarting on its own, and there we are. We've updated the software. Now we want to get close to the window here so that it will update the time and date. So when we first get our Forerunner 110 out of the box, it's always a good idea to go outside or uh, put the watch next to a window so they get a clear view of the sky to acquire the satellites. This might take a couple minutes. Now that we got uh, our date and time set, we can go and finish our user profile we'll just press and hold the page menu button for three seconds to access the menu and from here we just simply scroll down to see the options that we have so we'll again we'll just go down to user profile set our age our weight our height gender and our activity class refer to your manual uh, to see what activity class you are, but if you are running three times a week, uh, give or take, uh, then your activity class is probably around the six, five, six area. So you enter that, and there you go. So now you can go outside, go out for a run, or set up your heart rate monitor, a few other things I'll cover in other videos, but other than that, that's how you get up and running with your Forerunner 110.